So in this video, I'm going to go over a drill to help you guys with your rhythm in boxing. Now there are always the standard tools, skip rope and the speed bag, as well as just your boxing in general. A lot of guys are going to be natural with rhythm. It's going to come from your training. So in other words, whether you focus on rhythm or not, if you have speed, accuracy, skill, you're able to get your body from A to B, hit your target and get out. The rhythm is built into all of that. So a lot of people are concerned about rhythm, but it almost seems that they're more concerned about balance and coordination, which ties in. So this is just a basic drill that's going to help you guys if you have a hard time with rhythm and mobility. And I'll break it down for you right now, uh, how to start it and how to build it up. Okay. So a basic rhythm is a rock back and forth, and it looks like this to start. Pretty much like a warm-up drill. Now what I also want to do is be able to move. Okay, so let's break that down. First thing is the rock back. The way you want your feet proper, like a boxer who's mobile, is you want your toes straight or almost even slightly inverted. You want to be on the balls of your feet, but you want to have a firmness. What you don't want is this, okay? Because then when you got to throw, oftentimes your hip is locked. Here, it's easier to go with your hip. Here, it's easier to rock back and forth. It's easier to pivot. If I'm here, a lot of things are just that little bit harder, split second slower, less mobility. <clears throat> the other thing you don't want is this. Okay, you'll see that in a lot of fitness classes. You know, just kind of a twisty back and forth. That's just moving your body, it's not really boxing specific. The other thing you don't want is this. Okay, that's its own move. But that's not what we're doing in this case. And the last one you do not want is this. Okay? So when you're rocking, outside edges of your feet, knees bent, you're going to move both feet, land on the balls of your feet, and back. See how they barely move, almost like I'm just lifting myself and moving over here. So to start, I'm going to go there and back, like this, a nice little rock, like a springy little rock, rock back, okay? Then I'm going to go twice, boom, 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 okay? So it's almost like three times, okay? Then you want to try to get into this rhythm. Now here's where the hand and the foot timing comes in together. When I go to the right, my right hand punches out. When I go to the left, my left hand punches out. A lot of people in the beginning will do opposite. They'll go like this, but that doesn't really work with how your body is moving in boxing, especially off the jab. So you want to get used to this right, moving to the right, left moving to the left, right, left, right, left. From the side here, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. From the front, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Okay, so you have that drill right there, rocking. And you can just do this for a round. Uppercuts, hooks, just working your rhythm. Next piece that breaks into that before we get to the motion is a shoe shine. A shoe shine is your fast rhythm. Right, left, right, left. Okay. Now I could go from the rock backs to the shoe shine and back again. Rock backs, shoe shine, rock backs, shoe shine, 
rock backs, shoot shine, rock backs, and that's gonna help me transition between different types of rhythm. Okay, now the next drill, motion. Here I am. Okay, I put the weight on the right foot, I skip. Okay, skip. I'm not doing this, leaving that space. Okay, now you're going to time your hands and feet together. The left hand, one, to go really slow, punch. See how slow that goes? Punch. Two hands. Punch, punch. I lean. I punch. I switch. I punch. Back. So quick it goes punch, 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 punch. To the right. Punch, 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 punch. You'll almost be better off doing it fast, you could probably really mess up your brain doing it slow, but I'm trying to break it down for you so you really see each piece. Here, I'm getting my hands and my feet moving together, and then I'm rocking back, and then shoe shine, and rocking back, shoe shine, moving. Moving, rocking back, shoe shine, moving, moving. Okay, so that drill, aside from speed bag, skipping rope, standard boxing, and your basic rhythm, is going to help you with all of your rhythm in general in boxing, hand and foot coordination, timing and balance in your mobility. So work that drill, work the variations. If you have any questions on it, leave a comment below in the comment box and I'll get back to you on it. So recently, I hooked up uh, a partnership with Quest Nutrition. And uh, I've been eating these things nonstop. So if you guys would like to win a box of uh, Quest bars, go to the Quest Nutrition YouTube page. I'm gonna leave a link in the description below. Subscribe and in the comments say, Precision Striking sent me here and they're going to enter you in a contest to be eligible to win a box of Quest Nutrition Bars. All right, thanks for watching guys. Peace. Remember, subscribe to my channel. I've got new videos every week. Check out my instructional videos. Here, if you click on the video on the left, that's going to take you to my instructional video trailers. If you click on the video on the right, that's going to take you to my most popular uploads. Thanks for watching guys. Peace.